I'm out of insults. Uh, welcome back hey. to... Welcome back to Duke Nukem Fuck Is This Gonna End Edition. Where we go into the generator room. Uh. Where we will find the president. Uh, I'm not even gonna worry about spoilers at this point. We find the president, he tells us to find the Octo King and destroy him. And then we have to go find, uh, you know, the Cycloid Emperor, blah 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 blah. The Octo King? Yes. The Octo King is yes. the bad guy here? The Octo King not is a bad guy the... for this area. Not. Oh. For this area. Cyclone oh, Emperor so we push that boss. door open, but we kick every other door open? Are you fucking serious? When the hell did that distinction come in? Duke. Thank God Almighty when Duke Nukem wanted to be polite? Question mark. Oh, so the president is the bad guy over this. That was a terrible reference. I hate myself for having to have heard that. <laughs> Is that supposed to be um, yes. America? Yes. Yes. Reference? Yes. That's supposed to be yep. a. Uh... Well, damn! I can't even remember the name of the thing now. I haven't seen the movie in years, so I couldn't even tell you. What's the name of it again, Gary? <sighs> Let me search Wikipedia. Yeah, beat me to it by a second. Alright, Team America. There you go. World Police. Team what? Team, oh, America, Team America, World, World Police. Police. Oh. That's Nothing they like Washington. Off, uh... Or that's a parody of um, Thunderbirds, right? Yes. I think so. It is a parody Thunderbirds of Thunderbirds. Thunderbirds, there we go. I know that if you watched it, you got to enjoy two uh, puppets making out. <laughs> oh, good. Okay. See things again. I will rephrase this. The world police. I much prefer the original Thunderbirds bits to the live action re movie they did. Went to orbit there for a second, kids. Lovely. Yeah, oh, he'd sure rather be in horrible. orbit rather than in this pathetic commentary. You mean the game? Yes. Or just because the we're not being commentary. as, uh... So, uh, so how, how are you how's, the, how's, the, how's space up there, kids? How are you doing? Did you um, I'm wondering when I'm going to get back yet? down to my comfortable chair. Ah, uh, okay. Did so you how are you supposed to set those generators yet? down? Uh, I have no idea how he's gonna shut them down. Something, 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 general bullshit. Oh, great. So, this is the, you know, this is the part that I'm gonna die a few times. I'm not gonna lie. Because Octo King is bullshit here. What? Press the old dude. Yep. What? Oh, hi. That doesn't look like an Octo King. No, we gotta deal with these guys first, though. Duke, not manly enough to fight robots. Uh, I just hate this part and this boss overall. And guess what? Since we're fighting Octo King, we have to fight the other um, octopus things that deflect some um, explosives and um, bombs at you. And guess what? Octo King gets hurt by explosives and bombs. So you see where the issue Lovely. is heading here. 
They basically, to make it difficult, they made it annoying. Yep. If you excuse me, I'm gonna go to play Pokemon. I have fun. I mean, I like a first person shooter as much as the next person. But, for my Octopus Pokemon, I'll go for Octopus based things. I'll either end up in Metroid or Pokemon. Um, really? I'm gonna curve you into sushi. Are you? All right. Okay, so the whole thing of carving you into sushi, I can at least accept. The valid in insult, right? Yeah, I guess. All right. So many reasons why this boss is bullshit. Number one. Um, fucking teleport, not teleport, but, you know, fucking death raids of bullshit. Reason number two. Um, he can smash against the, your only protection, which is over there. So that's reason number two. Reason number three. Your covers will be taken away by Octo King and get thrown at you during the fight. Oh so pretty much... You have to rely on power-ups that you have in hand at this point, which includes beer and, um... Dying. Yeah, a few nons, yeah. A few non-carrying what? A few non-carrying deaths later. So, yeah. I see, you skipped to when you finally completed the, the fight. Yep. Because Wait, who's the hell I think shooting? I think I literally died five times here. I think more blowing than yourself that. up there, man. Wouldn't surprise me. Did you blow yourself up there, man? Ah, well. What the heck? That's the Hollow Duke, isn't it? Yep. yep. Almost there. And yet he somehow still knows where you are. Well, a hologram only work only works so well. All right, come on. I'm almost done here. Her fucking zob. Oh, but guess what? He's not done yet. Oh god, don't tell me you're going to do it. Dun 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 dun. Okay. All right. So you have to hurry and finish him off. I wonder why. Why is that? Because if this gets closer, then he will smack you with your tentacles and that's a one hit KO. Really? So yep. You can get stepped on and it's not a one hit KO, but you get whacked with a tentacle and it's a one hit KO. Yep. I'm more concerned with how the hell does Duke have a tentacle? You fuck. Wait, what? You said he'll slap you with his tentacles. No. No. The Octo King will slap you with physical tentacles. Mess, It'll count as a one hit KO. So you have to. What do you say, crusty old guy? Yep. And that's the end and of I love Octo Duke's King. Line. There can only be one king. The fuck? Is that necessary to say at the end there, Duke? I don't know, but is this I necessary? Would it would have been perfect. Swearing is cool. I would. Have, it would have been a lot better if he had just stuck with. There can only be one king. Yeah. The mirrors work well in this game. Alrighty, guess how we end this level. Falling to our death. I wish. But no, that's not the case. So he willingly jumps down there and then screams, are you serious? Yeah. Duke Nukem secretly up the he's afraid of heights, I bet. Or water, <laughs> one or the other. No, that's Blaze the Cat and Sonic the Hedgehog, respectively. No, no, that's that's 
Sonic that's, the Hedgehog and Duke, Blazing apparently. Cat are far more manly than Duke Nukem. Pretty much. You know, that's very sad. <laughs> it's very sad orbit. when a cat it's and a hedgehog enjoyable. is more manly than you. <laughs> Pretty much. Every time All you right. get Space Voice Kits, I'm gonna ask you how Orbit is, just so you know. <laughs> okay. That'll be the running thing here for Duke Nukem Forever. Cheers, ma'am. What the hell did that vending machine say? It said dick or something on it. I'm gonna be per er, pretty irritated. I don't know. Uh, crack? Looks like crack. Is it much better? Yeah, it is not much better. Alrighty, so what you're supposed to do fair. here is push these filing or tool drawers down there. And you're supposed to know the how. The hell if I know. Don't know. I guess they expect you to accidentally bump into it. Or, I mean, at this point, you kind of know. I think the indication is around. the toolbox that's right in front of the twirling fan yeah. to begin with, I guess. But that third one should about do it. There you go. Now we can proceed. The ladder Why would someone in... Why would someone Why install would someone a ladder there? Them... Yeah, I have no idea. And I get lost I here. From again. Big surprise. Well, this game is not really good with directions. We've Fair noticed. Enough. Go down, young dumbass. Nope. Heck or not. That's not the case. So where are we supposed Sorry, to go? Bit. Oh, look. The Down tunnel. There. These little things remind me of the, uh, Rachni Warriors. <laughs> Agreed. Workers. Workers. Mm-hmm. Alrighty. Sorry, I just got done playing Mass Effect 1. Not a problem. More rats to step what? on. Were those were those mice like punching him? No. Rats it were sounded eating like they on were him. punching him. Yeah. But the I noises know. sounded like they were punching him. Yeah. Oh, that's the end of Man, that. That was that was and the level. Here's and here's the bullshit level. The underwater level. Is it as bad as Conker's at Verde underwater level? Uh, close to it. You have to rely on air bubbles to uh, <coughs> regain your oxygen. What the fuck is Meanwhile, this? Meanwhile, fucking hedgehog. This is gonna fuck up my hair. Oh God, really, Duke? Really? <laughs> Man, you are just the manliest motherfucker. We're so worried about your hair. <laughs> Alien invasion? Man, who cares about that? My hair. <laughs> fucking. <laughs> This guy. He's more, he's more girly than my girlfriend or Claire, for fuck's sake. Yeah, Pretty if much, you could see me now, you could definitely verify that. Well, I can't. Alrighty. So, I'm just making an assumption and hoping it's right. What's bullshit I'll about this level word. exactly? You know those um, alien creatures that we were dealing with while we were shrunk at one point in the level? Yeah, they can swim! And guess what? Your trajectory sucks underwater. Big fucking surprise. Yeah, uh, I think I, I think I, you know, do okay here. I just know this part is bullshit yeah, because you have to worry take, about you your health. Stand on the water thing. Yeah. Ah, uh, and guess what? We have to fight a boss. Underwater! How are you even swimming like that? That gun no alone idea. would weigh you down so heavily. I don't know. And how are you swimming forward while standing upright? I no mean, idea. Clearly, I could say, like, oh, I don't have perspective, so. Uh, just ignore it. Go on, please. Thank you. Yeah, they like, those things are tiny, you can hardly see them, they get stuck in places. And you're yep. gonna run out of air so sooner than they will. Yeah, uh, fair enough. I'm so still... we're done with that. Wait, what? Oh. 
Yeah. Right. That was the pause screen. Okay. Yep. Oh, hi, Cycloid Emperor. We'll deal with your ass in the last video. So instead of, like, shooting you through the windows, which he could probably easily break, he kind of just roars at you and keeps on going? Yep. Obviously, he doesn't consider you much of a threat. Well, I mean, it he should, sense. because you kick his ass in the end of Duke Nukem 3D. Hence why he has a black, a black eyeball. There's no uh, such thing as reasoning here. <laughs> and I get lost again. Big surprise. Because this game is so good at giving directions. God, that's fucking so where, blinding. So where am I supposed to go? Oh, I'll give you a hint. Down. Down. Down there? No. Down. We're supposed Down. to fall off of this thing. Yeah. Down. How would you know? All... It gives you every yeah, all... implication that you are supposed to stay there. Yeah. Yeah. All common sense from various games I've played like this all say the same thing. Stay on top. Yeah. Like down. Thank you. Hello, Wilhelm. Is that what that's called? Yep. The Wilhelm scream. Yeah. Oh, look. They're like, ow! Yeah. Like Wilhelm. Doesn't surprise me. This game was called developed by Gearbox. Well, I'm just well, I've been trying to find and figure that out, but I never realized what it was. Yeah, movies that are pretty. Wait, does his shotgun have a uh, have yes. his own personal logo on it? Yep. Brown. But well, why not thing when you can thing? Why All is right. he holding it like that anyway? I have no idea. I honestly What are you don't. talking about? What point is he holding it as? Yeah, earlier he was reloading it while holding it like and across his chest. Now he's like holding it up in the air again. Mm -hmm. eh. I don't know. I think that happens when you're running. I think. Mm. Not so sure. Well, if that's the case, that would make somewhat sense. Which doesn't fit with this game. Yeah. And guess what? We can't progress anywhere until we clear out this room. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go to sleep again. Good night. <laughs> almost at the end of the video. Nobody will blame you. Smack. Squeal. Squeal. <sighs> I don't want you to die hard, please. I've never watched Die Hard, to be honest. The main character is more likable than this dick. Yeah. Or a lot of people. Hell. I'd rather even listen pre to- Even President Nixon is more likable than Duke Nukem, and he's dead. I'd rather- I'd rather listen to four hours of Elliot- of Elliot's stories from Left 4 Dead 2 than watch this show. <laughs> eh, Elliot's stories were funny at least. At least an attempt to be funny.